These are the four common reasons why your dog's feet get knuckled. In this video, I'll share simple body work and massage that can help with the age-related knuckling. You can reactivate your senior dog's body awareness that's getting a little rusty by continuing these works. So please stick around. I upload various types of canine massage and exercise tutorials and tips on how to help your aging dogs weekly. Mainly in Japanese, but some of the videos do have English subtitles, so if you like, please hit that subscribe button. Let's get started with the body work. We do this while your dog is standing, so the best time to do this is right before taking your dog for a walk. And this way, you can establish the routine easily. What you do is to take one of your dog's feet gently and let it knuckle on purpose. Then let your dog fix it. That's it. They may be able to fix it right away or they may take longer. If your dog is not responding, lightly rub the foot like this and try it again. Do this to not only the foot that knuckles but all four. Once you're done with each, try the foot that was slow in response or no response once again. If knuckling persists and the dog cannot reposition the foot by itself, you might want to consider reducing the time of inactivity in your dog's life. If your dog spends most of every, every day sleeping, encourage them to do more activities. It could be as simple as you're walking around the house and letting your dog follow you using treats, or letting them work on a snuffle mat or lick mat, preferably in the standing position. Offer them more sensory enrichment using sight, sound, smell, taste, and touch. Also, fix the knuckled foot as often as possible and massage as often as possible as well. Now moving on to the massage. Please do this while your dog is laying down and all relaxed. Many dogs don't feel comfortable with their paws being touched, so don't just grab them right away. Start with light strokes over their body. From head to tail, to the forelegs, and then to the hind legs. First, separate each toe and knead them in circular motions like this. For nails, hold them by the sides and apply pressure for a few seconds, then snap it like this. Also, make sure to knead behind the biggest pad as well. Finally, we finish off with very light strokes to stimulate the tactile senses. No weight at all, just barely touching. Long and slow strokes all the way down to the tiptoes. I hope you find it helpful. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye!